We have a deep-rooted resistance to quitting sugar. We grow up with an emotional and physical attachment to it. Just the idea of not being able to turn to it when we're feeling happy or want to celebrate or when we're feeling low or tired terrifies us. If not a sweet treat, then what? Well, I'll tell you what. A mind and body that's clean and clear. I guess it started as something of a curious experiment. You know, I was writing in a magazine column at the time and I was stuck for a topic, so I decided to quit sugar just for two weeks to see how it went. I also had an autoimmune disease and every doctor had told me to quit sugar. I really did not want to do it, um, but I guess it gave me the extra impetus. And then I started experimenting with recipes. You know, I had to eat something. I'd cut out processed food. When you quit sugar, you cut out processed food. And I had to go back to basics. Um, before I knew it, my experiment had gone further and I had a cookbook. So some of the favorite recipes in the book, you know, I get feedback on my blog constantly, you know, from readers. Um, the crunchy nut cheesecake is a real hit. Uh, the coconutty granola, you know, it's like granola but without the sugar. And I make it now with absolutely no sweetener at all. And it's beautifully, beautifully sweet from the coconut oil. At the end of the day, when you cut out sugar, you're cutting out processed food, you know, and you're getting back to eating the way that our grandparents used to eat before the advent of sugar and metabolic diseases. You know, it really is just about getting dense nutrition into your diet. It is not a diet, it's a way of living that's really quite sustainable. Middle-aged men with diabetes have come off their medication and some people have written to me telling me they've lost 80, 90 pounds just from quitting sugar. And then there's all those people who've changed the way they cook from my recipes. You know, that kind of thing really, really gladdens me. I'm no white-coated expert, but I did succeed in ridding my life of sugar and I did experience firsthand what worked and what certainly didn't. Now I want to share what I found and help as many people as I can make the leap to healthy, sugar-free living. I wish you luck and a whole lot of wellness. <laughs>